With us now is Jennifer Bell, and we're going to be talking about Bell Beachwear. Welcome to the show. How are you? Thank you for having me. So you are all about fashion. I am. Has that always been that way for you growing no, up? not okay. at all. All right. I never was really into fashion until I got older, and I think I started really liking what I liked, wanting to wear things, and it was really hard for me to find things. So I decided to uh, start making things that I liked, that I knew people would like to wear. And so you started out, you have beachwear, you have pocketbooks, you have all kinds of great things. We do. We, have, we first started off with a swimwear company. So I make a high, high quality, very affordable swimwear that are actually made in the USA, actually made in Florida. And that came with the bags, and then we make hats, and then we also specialize in bringing on other women-owned businesses to the marketplace. Starting out as a women-owned business, uh, what was that like for you? How did you decide to like, start and branch out on your own? Well, I think uh, my mother was a woman-owned business. She has owned her own business since 1989, and I always believed in women helping other women. So when I started the company, all I wanted to do was help my other girlfriends that didn't really have the, uh, the background that I had or the, the technology that we already had installed. And so I wanted to help them sell their products. So it's a women-owned, most of, most of the companies are also women-owned. Yeah, it's great. so exciting. Yeah. What makes a quality swimwear? When you say quality swimwear, how, how do you define quality? So I always Because I know when I'm wearing something, I know the difference, you know? So. Well, it's the one place, one item of clothing that a woman can't hide in. You can wear jeans that hold you in a little bit or a bathing suit, you're out there. And you want to show off things that you want to show off and things that you want to hide. So quality means that it holds in certain areas. It's not pinching you. When I was first looking at other brands, you would hear them go, <laughs> when you put it on. And no woman wants to hear that noise when you're trying on a bathing suit. Right. So I felt that I wanted it to be good quality that holds up. It's very affordable because there are a lot of uh, more expensive lines out there. But this is high quality, very affordable. And when you put it on, it feels good. You, you actually enjoy wearing it. And also coverage. You know, like how many times do you go get a cheap swimsuit or whatever and you look at yourself and you're like, I kind of look naked. That's not going to work for me, right? So you, you need to have... Uh, the pieces in place that are going to make you look lovely and exactly. elegant. And I noticed that your suits, they're all beautiful. Thank you. And it's all I like to mix and match the sizes. And if there's someone that needs a custom size made or they want to have a little bit more added to the bottom or to the top. So all my pieces are all customized. And that's also fantastic. Yeah. Now tell us about these great bags. So the bags were started off being, let's just say, for the beach. But now being up here in the rain in New York, they're perfect for the rain and also great for the snow. So they just were something to look good with your swimwear, but also look day, look great for every day. Now, I love this bag because this bag is, it's more like, it's just nude. It's, it's like nude. skin. It's gorgeous, yeah. It is just it's, absolutely. It's, that's my best seller. This is, it's gotta be, yeah. because this could go with anything. It's absolutely lovely. And the quality and the stitching and everything, every attention to detail is important to you, obviously. Thank you. It is. Um, so when you decided to uh, expand, as you said, you right. have all these different things. Um, each season, how do you know what you're going to put up, put forth? You find out the colors that are going to be hot that year. But it also, it's very, for me, I believe fashion is very basic. So you want to take chances on certain things, but then you want to have pieces that are just always going to be for every year. They can always just bring out. And certain colors like the, the red and the blue, the black's always constant. This is great for going out at night. <laughs> You know, someone spills a drink. I was going to take a glass of water, but I thought you might kill me. I, uh, <laughs> but you can pour a glass of water, a glass of wine on your bag and not worrying about it getting ruined. Yeah, and that's what people, you know, it's just like wipe and wear. It's all, exactly. You're good to go. You take some dish I think, soap. I think this bell, like this one's going to be good <laughs> with me. Uh, but Sorry. yeah, I've noticed that too. And, and that's something that the television, you really can't see that. But, right. but yeah, this is completely durable. Yeah, so I'll be out and I'll just spill a glass of water on the bag and people look at me like, oh my goodness. And yeah, nothing it looks ever like happens silk. to it. It's great. It looks like silk, but Thank it's not. You. And they all come with a scarf. They either come with a lock or a little teddy bear and with a shoulder strap as well. You're also very philanthropic. We talked about this on the phone, and I told you that my mom had passed, uh, passed away from breast cancer. You were talking to me about, in October, what your company's doing. Correct. So we, we're giving away 10% of all of our proceeds to uh, Think Pink Challenge, which is uh, based out of Boca Raton. We wanted to make sure that the money was really going to someplace. And we knew that with the Think Pink Challenge, it was really going to go help the women in our community, but also in other communities to help bring you know, awareness to breast cancer and also fund some research. What type of mentoring do you like to do? Because I know that you're also helping, like you said, you love to help others. Is there like one thing in particular that you just like throw yourself in at? 
I think I throw myself in every day women helping other women. I believe that every woman should always help another woman grow and succeed. And I think for me that's been something I've learned since I was a little girl. The other charity that my husband and I are very uh, involved in is SOS Children's Village. So it's uh, foster care, uh, 70 foster kids that live in South Florida that we actually took in last summer for three nights. So they uh, were When displaced. you told me that, I was all, like almost in tears because I, I, I couldn't imagine like the children. Th there was one time I was driving down the street um, down south and there was an encampment underneath a bridge near a Salvation Army or whatever and there were children in this camp and I couldn't save them all. But the fact that you helped 70, you and your husband, like uh, kudos to that. Yeah. I applaud you. That's tremendously loving. We're very involved with them and, it, and it's a great and we have at SOS Children's Village, they have a 99% graduation rate and most of those and most, I think, 99% go off to college. So it's great. It's a great charity. And so. future entrepreneurs there, you, you, exactly. you just know it. You yeah. already know well, it. We love that because that's, they need someone to look up to and to say, wow, I can actually do something. And people helping other people, you pay it forward. So, so it's bellbeachwear.com. Bellbeachwear.com. So awesome. Thank, Thank you, you very much for being here. I can't wait. I'm going to be doing a little shopping with yeah, you. Whatever but you how, want. how great is this? It's great. <laughs> It's fun. Stay tuned for more on Live It Up. We love showcasing entrepreneurs. We hope you enjoyed this visit. And please go to her website.